How's the arm? Fine. Are you sure you don't want me to have a look at it? What I want you to do is stay away from me for a while. Excuse me? Thanks to your overreaction today, I had to tell Jay about the pregnancy. But you didn't mention who the father is. Donor Mark, not father. And I told her what I've told everyone else. Hey, uh, you've got your follow-up ultrasound today, right? I'll let you know how it goes. Well, hang on a minute. When I loaned you that money, we agreed you'd show me some consideration. I'm coming with you to the scheme. No way! You have already done enough today. Please leave it. This is something I need to do on my own. Okay. Okay. Tell me to sort off if you want, but I promise that I won't say another word about Kirk, and I promise that I will mind my own business. I just really want to be here for you. I know you didn't want me to come, but we had... Mark! Hi. No way. Jay. What is she doing here? Well, I don't have to ask you the same thing. Dad. Can we not talk about this now, please? So, you managed to talk tons around again. We're ready for you now. I thank you. Tanya doesn't know, does she? No, and I want to keep it that way. How can you do this to her? This has nothing to do with you. Stop it. Right now, I want you to go. Good idea. I'll see you, Mark. Both of you. They're waiting for me. Call me later. Leave it. Just go. Maya. I'm coming. Get back to work. Maya, come on. No definite results until tomorrow. It was so dumb of you to turn up. How was I supposed to know you'd ask Jay to come with you? It was your fault too. You made such a fuss when I fell over. I had to tell her I was pregnant. And I wanted her to come with me. <sighs> Whatever. If just for once you could have kept your distance, but you just keep butting in and now Jay knows everything. And she talked aren't you? No. She knows how much it would hurt her. Well, she found it easy to hurt you. And you know what she thinks of me. Yeah, well, I'm starting to feel the same way. Look, I know she won't blab, but I'll talk to her, OK? Coffee? Or something stronger? Nothing. I want to talk to you. I'll just beat you do. I know how you must feel about what's happening with Maya. Taking advantage of a desperation to have a child? Yeah, I've got a few thoughts on that. It isn't like that. Father of her child, Mark. Part of her life forever. Well, congratulations. You finally got what you wanted. Can you keep it down? Not the proud dad? Well, there's a surprise. There are other people's feelings to take into consideration. Yeah, like uh, Tanya's. The last thing I want to do is hurt her. Because mm, she is your wife after all. Yes, she is my wife and I want to protect her, which means you keeping your mouth shut. You go and do the one thing guaranteed to break Tanya's heart and then you try and make me responsible? I don't think so. You know, Maya thinks you're a better person than that. Yeah, she does. But you don't. I need your promise. Not. Maya being happy is far more important to me than making you sweat. But if not from me, Mark, it's going to come from somewhere else. Eventually, Tans will find out, and when she does, there won't be a damn thing you can do. Hey, Mark and I have just lost $4,000. What? All that money, gone, just like that, because he lost his wallet and didn't tell the bank. Tanya, settle. We don't know for sure that we won't get it back. Well, Serena the bank. I will. Now. I haven't got time now to wait to get a real person to speak to. Well, I did. Do you mind leaving it up to me today? I would if I thought you'd do it, except you'd probably forget. Can you believe he's been so calm about this? Four thousand dollars. It's a huge amount of money. Yeah. When did this happen? Not sure. Hi, Plus. Ring the bank today, or I'll be paying them a visit first thing in the morning. Man. 
money for the obstetrician and Tanya sent in his $4,000 missing from the account. So he's lied and said that his credit card was stolen, but she's already honoured him to find out from the bank if they'll cover it. Which they would if it was stolen. I don't know how he's going to explain it, but it better be good or if she's going to front up to the bank. Oh, hell. I'm sorry, but I have to say it. What were you thinking? Mark, of all people... He was there and he volunteered. All I wanted was a baby. I've kept telling myself all these lies. It doesn't matter because I won't get pregnant. It doesn't matter because I know how to handle Mark. It doesn't matter because Tanya will never find out. Okay. Mark just won't stay out of it. He always wants to be there and I keep pushing him away. But then I'm suddenly hit with something like an obstetrician bill. And who do I go groveling to? It's such a mess. I can't believe I've been so incredibly stupid. Well, we want what we want. Could still turn out okay. That's crap and you know it. It's going to be very, very ugly and the worst thing is, I deserve it. Nobody calling us... back off Maya. Just let her get on with her pregnancy without you breathing down her neck. It's my baby. But you don't want Tanya knowing that, do you? Are you trying to blackmail me? No, I'm telling you what's best for everyone. No. As usual, you're trying to get me out of the picture, which means you think you've still got a chance with Maya. You're dreaming. Maybe I am dreaming. That makes the two of us. You've always wanted much more from Maya than she was ever going to give you, but still you keep trying. But now, you're lying to Tanya and you're cheating on her. Hardly. In your heart you are. No, I'm not. So you don't want to lose Tanya? Of course I don't. Right. Then there's only one way we can do this. What's this? A bank check for four grand. You can replace the money that you gave Maya and Tanya doesn't have to know. All you have to do, Mark, is just leave Maya alone. You know it's the right thing to do for you and Tanya and for Maya and her baby. Now, earlier, you asked me for my promise, so now I need yours. Okay. 